Kato. No, that was your cue to smile. <laughs> Happy artist. Aren't we all? Because I really wanted to be a vet. I really, there were several things I wanted to be. All in the while, in the meantime, I had to start working at the U.S. Postal Service as a rule carrier. I went to Cameron University for art. My scholarship flunked out. <laughs> and my brother could really draw when we were kids way better than I could. And uh, the whole time I was in the military, if I was in a rice paddy in Okinawa looking up at the stars as helicopters were coming in to pick us up, I thought I could have I went off to college right after high school. Can you cut with scissors? Are you a good scissor cutter? Do you like that? No. It's like it's, it's in our heads. We have to find it ourselves, and it's in our. It's what we eat. Art being made for specific purposes, and uh, I thought this is fascinating. As much as we, as human beings, say we're different than somebody else, we're actually the same. Uh, we've created works of art with what is around us. I would like to see other artists pick up on this movement and other non-artists. I'd like to see other people in the Indian community see the power of healing from within and, and relying on our traditional ways. I mean, this is what our ceremonies and our dances are, are all about. It's about renewal of self. Diabetes is a, a a terrible epidemic. It's like every member of my family growing up has had diabetes. The purpose of having health is so that you can enjoy life. And one of the very important things for enjoying life is the spiritual and artistic aspects of life. Uh, these are the things that make life worth living. Native Americans are so disproportionately affected by diabetes. You guys, the physicians, the, the people that are involved in the program, you give these children, these families hope. And I know I just found out I'm leaving. I want to go to South Dakota. So Gerald not being close, it's just his mind, his humor, and everything. It's difficult because we don't get to uh, see see him and talk to him and, and hear all his ideas. Spirit O is back there. We can bring forward to today and incorporate to what we do to a modern day circumstance or situation. I, I really feel like something's going to happen, but I don't think it's going to be anything that anybody knows about what it's going to happen. They can tell you what they think is going to happen, but what's going to happen is not. And I think it's going to be powerful, whatever it is, and I'm kind of excited about it. I've never known.